subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon for latest videos. Hi guys, I'm really really excited to share with you today's video. It's about organizing. I'm always up for organizing things. I This is something I really really enjoy doing. This is why I'm sharing my journey with you guys. So today we are tackling the top of the fridge area. Now let me tell you something. Over the years, um, I've just kind of collected stuff on top of the fridge. If you have children, you will know that this sometimes happens where we don't want the kids to reach certain stuff and then we keep putting it on top of the fridge, all of that fun stuff. So yeah, watch this video and let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. Now let's get started with today's video. okay guys so this is actually really really crazy but these are all the things that i had on top of my fridge it was accumulating like since months actually for long 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 time and now i'm gonna sort it nicely into categories and put it all into this organizer here i've got like a five tier organizer and hopefully all of it is going to look really really nicely organized and all of this is gonna go into uh some really good location where they actually belong so as you guys can see i've laid out all the stuff in front of me so i can see them clearly each and everything I am kind of trying to figure out which item goes where and trying to put them all together into categories into groups uh, for example crayons and for, um, or pencils go together or um, play-doh st set goes in one or academic learning stuff goes in one so yeah stuff like that so finally all of it has started to make sense i know exactly what item um, to put where and it's actually much easier this way to categorize stuff and i would suggest you guys to group things together as well to make your life easy if there is any trash it goes straight into the trash bin and uh, yeah it's just um pretty much straightforward so now we're gonna put everything in these organizers okay guys so this is the final result i really love how this turned out i've put some labels as well on each and every container so that it makes kids life and my life much more easier and organized and kids are gonna know exactly where things belong and this way they are also gonna learn to tidy up by themselves and yeah so i really love how this turned out so over here i've got mixed toys for the children i've left this space a little bit empty because it's always good to embrace empty space there's no need to fill up all the empty spaces around your house and if they get um, some gifts in future or some if I get them some toys in future little ones I can just put them in here and this is like a weekly rotation box here I've put like a monkey game for the children and every week I'm gonna put a new game in this box so they have something new to play with every week and over here i've got some play-doh toys this used to be a huge mess before and i'm so glad it's just so clean and tidy now here i've got some kids learning stuff and there's another kids learning stuff over here like they've got some things some sticker books and all that bits and bobs all of it just goes down here and I'm actually so, so happy the way all of it turned out. It's just so great. Yeah, I'm pleased. 
So all the extra things that I actually didn't want the kids to um, be able to access on their own. I've kept all of them in this container here from Poundland. Um, it's very useful to have this large container. I'm going to keep this upstairs in my room because if you are a parent, you will know that there are things that you don't actually want your children to touch or um, take by themselves. So this is all under my supervision. If whenever if they do want anything from here, they can ask me and I've categorized all this into like crayons, chalks and then other stuff as well. But yeah, all of this is going to stay here with me. If they want to have it, they can ask me for it. Guys, check out this space. Is that the same space? It just looks so, so amazing. Wow, it just looks so clean, so tidy. I'm so grateful. I still kept some games at the corner in the kitchen because I don't really want the kids to reach up there. And in future, I'm going to remove the games from there as well. If you really enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It really, really means a lot to me. And you can also share this video with your friends and family who can benefit from this video and feel inspired as well. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Until then, take care. Bye. Love you all.